Gifford's district director, Ron Barber, continues to recover from the physical wounds he suffered in the shooting, but he says the emotional toll still, still lingers and haunts him to this day. ABC 15's Tim Vetcher shows us how Barber remembers the moment the shooting started and the heroic act that likely saved his life. Two weeks have passed since that fateful Saturday morning in Tucson, but time has done little to ease the pain of Ron Barber. The shock has not worn off, I have to say. Um, the tape still plays over and over in my head. I can't help but continue to see the shooter rush past me and shoot Congresswoman Giffords, and then... Um, he started spraying all of us with bullets. Barber had accompanied his boss, Gabrielle Giffords, to her Congress on Your Corner event when gunshots rang out. Surveillance video shows federal judge John Roll push Barber to the ground to shield him, but that act of heroism cost Roll his life. I felt some contact with somebody or something, and it could well have been that the judge uh, was trying to protect me. Uh, if that's the case, I'm absolutely um, I'm just devastated that his life might have been given uh, to help me. Um, I'm grateful, but um, it's, hard, it's hard to take. Now out of the hospital and back home recovering from his injuries, Barber says he has no feelings whatsoever for suspected shooter Jared Loeffner, but considers Loeffner's parents, Amy and Randy, victims just like him. Nancy and I have been talking about, you know, how, what that must be like for them, and all I can say is that we send them our love and, and we, we pray for their recovery too. Now, Barber says he does plan to return to work one day, but given the nature of his injuries, it's still unclear tonight when that might happen. Live in the Satellite Center, I'm Tim Vetcher, ABC 15.